There are so many talented and beautiful women in Bangladesh and you guys have requested for us to do part two of our 10 most beautiful Bangladeshi women series. So here it is. Hey guys, what's happening? Welcome back to FTD Facts. My name is Leroy Kenton and I want you guys to watch this video until the very end so that you'll see if any of your favorites, maybe all of your favorites made it to this list. Let's just jump in right now. Starting at number 10, we have Jaya Ashan. Jaya Ashan is a Bangladeshi actress and producer. Jaya Ashan has been one of the busiest actors in Bangladesh. She has skillfully portrayed a wide range of characters on screen. And starting her career, she began as a model and later as a TV actress. And she currently works mostly in the Bangladeshi and Indian Bengali film industries. She won the Bangladeshi National Film Award for Best Actress four times for her performances in the films Gorilla in 2011, as well as Chora Bali in 2012, Zero Degree in 2015, and Debi in 2018 among other awards that she's won. Number nine brings us the beautiful Dilara Hanif Purnima. She is mainly known by her stage name, simply Purnima, and she was born in July, 1981. Purnima is a Bangladesh actress who became very famous after her role in E. Jibon Tomer's film, Monir Majhi Tumi. Purnima then went on to star in a number of other films. She won Bangladeshi National Film Award for Best Actress for her performance in the film Ora Amaki Balo Hoti Dilo Na in the year 2010. And although Purnima's birth country is Bangladesh, her parents originally came from Pakistan. Number eight brings us Shataj Munira Hashem. Sataj Munira Hashem was born on May 22nd, 1998. And she's an actress as well as a model, of course, from Bangladesh. And she's appeared in Bengali television dramas. She's appeared in music videos, as well as several short films. She has a very promising future in the career of film and the media. And she especially is noted for her vibrant personality and of course, her looks. Just to list some of her other works, she's worked with Bangla Link in various TV commercials and ad campaigns, and she has appeared in TV plays as well as TV movies, most notably Chini Gura. Rafiat Rashid Mithila is up next. She was born in the year 1981, and she's also known simply as Mithila. She's a multi-talented model as well as an actress. And she also is a very popular vocal composer and songwriter. She learned to dance from the Benuka Lotikola Academy. And she learned music from the Hindal Academy as well as acting. Well, she learned that from the Lok Natyodol Children Theater. In her career, she has appeared in many dramas and TV shows, and she gained a whole lot of fans that follow her and love her in Bangladesh. She has also acted in the very popular series named Houseful. Moving on now to number six, we have Nasreen Akhtar Nipun. Nasreen Akhtar Nipun is a Bangladeshi film actress and entrepreneur. She's commonly referred to by her stage name Nipun and definitely, of course, that's much faster to say than her full name. Either way though, Nasreen Akhtar Nipun was born on June 9th, 1984. And interestingly, her life has taken her across various different continents. She earned her bachelor's in computer science from Moscow State University. And from there, she then moved to Los Angeles, California in the United States. Nasreen Akhtar Nipun debuted in her acting career back in the year 2006. And then she went on to act into more films, including Poor Choi in 2013. Then in 2017, she was elected as an active member of Bangladesh Film Development Corporation. So yeah, there you go. Actor, it's all in her name. Pun intended. Halfway to number five, here we have Sabila Noor. Sabila Noor is one of the most popular new Bangladeshi TV actresses as well as models. She's acted in many different TV dramas and she became popular as the imaginary girl in the romantic comedy TV film called Monkey Business. And some of her other popular works were Teen Teen, Shoto Danar Prajapoti, as well as three friends and many more. She also appeared in many TV commercials and she made her acting debut on the telefilm U-Turn 
back in the year 2014. Moziza Ashraf Mona Lisa is up next. She was born on October 10th, 1984 in Dakla, Bangladesh. She is a Bangladeshi film actress, model, dancer, and TV actress. Now, she started off her career by appearing in TV commercials and stage dancing. Moziza Ashraf Mona Lisa is very well known for her appearance in the TV series Sikandar Box in 2012, as well as the movie titled X Factor in 2007. She was known for her beauty very early on, like even back in the year 2000. Moziza Ashraf, she won the Miss Photogenic Award. Peya Janatul comes up next at number three. Her full name is Janatul Ferdus Peya, but she also just goes simply as Paya Janatul as her screen name. She's a model, actress, and a lawyer. And she's actually the first model from Bangladesh who appeared on Vogue India, the magazine cover for it. She started off her career as a ramp fashion model. And then she made her first debut in Trabali, which is the name of the movie. And then she started acting in regular Bangladeshi and international movies. This woman, she's very gifted and talented in many ways. She completed her Bachelor of Law from the University of London. And she's a beauty pageant title holder. And she was also crowned Miss Bangladesh. She also is an international TV anchor and she has covered various events like the Cricket World Cup. Number two brings us Naila Nayam. Naila Nayam is a Bangladeshi model and actress and she entered show business as a runway model and then became an actress. And an interesting fact about Naila is that she completed her bachelor's degree in dental surgery at Dhaka City Dental College to become a dentist. But when she's not busy cleaning people's teeth, she has been spending a lot of time very busy in the acting world. She's well known for her movies like Ratrier Jatri in 2019, Masti Unlimited in 2015, as well as Pago Kori Ador Kori in 2019. She's also known for using social media to gain stardom, notably Facebook, which really helped elevate her clout as a professional entertainer. So, you know, she's put in a lot of work and it's definitely paid off. Pori Moni is at number one in this video. She is somebody that you guys are expecting to see in part one. And her birth name is Shamsunahar Smirti, but Pori Moni is just simpler as her stage name. She began modeling after she completed her HSC, which is higher school certificate in the year 2012. And it was from there that her career really began. She's a well-known rising Bangladeshi film actress, and she's famous for the movie Rana Plaza, as well as Ami Dana Kata Pori Song. Her role in Rana Plaza, which was based on the Rana Plaza disaster, was the role that really got her a lot of attention from the public. Pori Muni has quickly become perhaps the most debated actress for her bold and romantic scenes in her movies. She definitely does not hold back. And that brings us to the end of this episode. This was part two of the 10 most beautiful Bangladeshi women. There are so many more to look at, but if you want to see a part three, let me know down below and I'll be sure to work on it or not. Either way, guys, really hope you enjoyed this one. Leave a like if you did. Until next time, stay awesome, stay educated, and I'll see you soon.